Let's add a Teradata system to our Nexus. So go to the Systems tree and right click and say Add Data Source Connection. The Data Source Connection screen comes up. Press the drop down and pick the system you want to add and we're going to add Teradata. Notice the color's default is orange for Teradata, but we can change it to any color. We're going to go with blue, and that's what color the system's going to be and the tabs will be. Now, press the Add New button. You're in the User DSN tab, and you can go to the System DSN tab, or really the User DSN, doesn't matter, but you will hit Add, and you will be adding your driver. We're going to add a Teradata driver that we got from Teradata and we'll put finish. Now we put the name of the system as we want to call it. We can name it anything. We're going to call this Teradata Virtual. I will put the IP address in and then I have to put in my username and I can put my password in here but I don't have to right here. It'll even say hey this isn't actually secure and I go well that's okay. I'm going to do this. Now I press OK. I'm back to the main screen. You must press the refresh button and then you can choose the system Teradata Virtual that I just created. There's the login. Now this is where you have to put in your password and you can then say remember or you'll be prompted for it. Now notice my Teradata Virtual system is here. I can open it up and it now exists. There's my all my tables. It's that simple. Nexus.